We want to add a sound to a flash animation. So the first thing we want to do is find the sound that we're going to use. So I will go to findsounds.com. In this case, I'm going to look for a whistle. I'll click search. And in fact, many examples of a whistle come up. Notice for each one it tells you the type of file, the length and time of that sound clip. Okay, so I'm going to scroll down to this last one. I'd like to use it. It's uh, almost four seconds in length. I will right click on the link and choose Save Link As. And it's a train, it's a WAV file. And I uh, will put that right there in that folder and then go back to our Flash page. And now I need to import some things to my library to use. So I'll choose File import to library and I'll go ahead and import that wave file which is my sound file while I'm at it I'll import my image which is a tra some train clip art so import to library and there it is I've got them both ready to go so I'm ready to start working on my animation first thing I'm going to do however is to name that layer background and insert a line across the page which will serve as my train track and then I'm going to add another layer and call that train and as you can guess we'll be putting our train on that layer okay we'll move it over just a bit using our selection tool and convert that to a symbol, call it train, and there we go. And then we'll go to about frame 50 and insert a keyframe. We'll do that on both layers. And again on the train layer, we'll move the image all the way to the end side of the stage there. And create a motion tween and sure enough you'll see the train move across the stage now let me move that down just a bit with the arrow key and now we're ready to add our sound so we'll need to create another layer insert a layer we'll name that layer sound and on that layer I will, from my library again, notice I have that WAV file or sound file. I'll literally drag that to the layer, the sound layer. And you'll notice how it inserts it on that layer. And you can tell it's about the right length with some silence at the end, which is fine. So if we want to test this, there we go. So I need to save this. It'll be... Uh, Let's see, last name, FA4, looks good, and in fact, export it now as a movie with the same name, and everything's good, we can check it out. Okay, and what you notice is it loops, we'll talk next about how to add a stop action.